Hi guys, this is Dohana Shivanan here and I so enjoyed making that video with you guys yesterday that I thought I'm gonna make one more video. You know, initially I was feeling really silly to make these videos talking about the law of attraction and I don't know what not. But then I happened to stumble across this video of Oprah's where I saw Jim Carrey and Will Smith talking about the same topic and I was like, hey, even I can do it. <laughs> and so I have to thank them for me being motivated to talk about all this stuff. So today I'm going to talk about the law of attraction and health and how you can use it to improve your health and to become really fit and fine. So I'm going to start with explaining how our brain is basically a transmitter. Now when I mean by, what I mean by saying that our brain is a transmitter as in like we send, send signals from our brain. And the best example of that is telepathy, like when you think of a friend and then that uh, friend randomly just calls you and you're like, oh my god, I was just thinking about you. And this, I mean, it's not that you've experienced like one or two times in your life. Everyone's experienced this like a million times. So that kind of proves that our brain is truly a transmitter. So, um... So now, what I'm trying to explain out here is we basically are sending signals from our brain. Now, our brain actually has all these uh, different neuropathways and when you think of a thought, so your neuropathways kind of get connected and then, ding, ding, you send a signal out there. So it's either you, your brain is a good transmitter or it is a weak transmitter. So, the better your neural connectivity is, the better a transmitter you have. Now, now not many people do have good neural connectivity. So, in able to enhance it, you can do that with different different types of drugs, and um, like there are these smart drugs out there. And my fa my personal favorite is DHA. I mean, you pop a DHA, it's like a vitamin. It's not some you know, no side effects, nothing. You just pop a DHA and you can feel it. Hey, my brains are working. Like you actually can feel it, okay? So that's my personal favorite, just take DHA. I mean, DHA is a very, very common thing. It's, you know, babies have it in their milk. And yeah, so it's how good a signal you send out there. And it's not just sending the signal. So when you send a signal out there, you gotta feel it also. So your brain is one uh, transmitter, but the main transmitter is your heart, is when you feel it. So you think it and then you feel it and then it happens. So now when it comes to good health, like you want good health, so you just say, you you know, people say you say it in the positive present tense, like I am a picture of health. I am a picture of health. You keep repeating it, repeating, I am a picture of health. Now. The concept of repeating is, now our mind, there are, we have two minds, we have the conscious mind and we have the subconscious mind. So the subconscious mind cannot differentiate between what is real and what is not real. So whatever you put in your subconscious mind, it's going to believe it no matter what. So when you're saying, I'm a picture of hell, I'm a picture of hell, it just gets stuck in your subconscious mind and you send that signal out there to the universe and then you have to experience good health. That's how the law of attraction works when it comes to health. Now, some people, they are not comfortable with like saying the positive present tense, like I am a picture of health. It, they find it difficult to believe that. So for such people, maybe a phrase saying that every day I'm getting better and better. Every day I'm getting better and better. Every day I'm getting better and better. So when you say something like that, that is a little bit more believable statement. So it's easier to practice using a phrase like that. And uh, so yeah, so you keep repeating repetition. That is the key to making the law of attraction work. It's repetition. You repeat, repeat, repeat and you put it in your subconscious mind 
your brain sends out the signal out there in the universe and the universe has to get those kind of situations, circumstances and events for you to experience perfect health. And that's how it works. It's, it's that simple. Now I also spoke about um, astrology yesterday and how certain things are not in our control. But what I have noticed is when it comes to health, the law of attraction actually works like magic because see that is something which is a basic necessity for for humans like to feel to, to have good health because if you don't have good health you just cannot do anything in life so the desire of wanting good health so when you practice the law of attraction when it comes to good health saying that every day I'm getting better and better every day I'm getting better and better and then you send the signal with your brain and then you feel it but that desire is so strong that you know even if astrologically you're supposed to have bad health it changes it so it, it does work like magic when it comes to health I have personally experienced it and I've seen it with others also so yeah so when it comes to health you know the law of attraction really really works now uh, I would like to share this with you. Like I came across this video of uh, Greg Braden. Now he's a scientist, and there is he actually documented this uh, video of how, like, there is this hospital in China where, like, if you have like a terminal disease, like for example a cancerous tumor, so they have it where a, a screenshot where you can see real time the cancerous tumor, and then they have these cute Chinese therapists around and they are chanting now chanting 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 and putting positivity in trying to make the patient feel and believe that they're perfectly fine and apparently their chanting word means like all is cured all is cured all is cured and it's, it's so much uh, vibrations are so high and they like you know send the vibrations so strong and then you can actually in three minutes see the tumor vanish on the screen so you could probably look it up like Greg Braden cancerous tumor China or whatever and just see that video it's pretty cool I was so impressed seeing that that if I ever go to China I'm gonna go to that hospital <laughs> at least I mean I don't want to be sick I just want to go and see other people <laughs> so um yeah, that was my video today on the law of attraction and health and I hope you guys liked it and stay tuned for some more nice videos. Thank you.